and good morning people welcome back to Sakodan 4 I've just faced a game here plays a game of uh, read upon with Rita there <coughs> sorry and uh, we're now back on the high seas I've done as much recruiting as I can at this moment in time and what we need to do now is go after the uh, Kika. Because, well, we need to get, um, we need to do a few things in the story before we can go back to recruiting. I am currently at the Isle of Mordu, and I've just realised that I can put the names up on places, so still need to go up to India at some point, but that's fine, I don't really need to do it right now. Nay, Narnell, Donut Island, Mordu. They're the places I have access to right now. Obal, Middleport, Lazriel. Not really. I do have access to Ilya, I just haven't gone there yet. But where we're we going there now is the nest of pirates over here, which sort of means I've got to go a bit on the high seas and. well. Yeah, go on to this, uh... Water. And float my way over. This could take a few minutes, it could take an hour, it could take however long it wants to give me. Hopefully it won't be too long and I'll get there. Uh, In terms of story, we haven't really had that much. The story itself, this game, isn't really that long. It's all the bits in between which make up the game. There are a lot of side stuff. But Speckled Ray is nothing too special. Thank you for that critical. So, I'm going to go down over to Nesta Pirates and I will see you when it comes into view. Because, yeah, or, or when enemies change. More likely the, the nest is going to come into view. Hello, we've got some new crabs here, some rock crabs. I'm expecting them to be just as good as most other enemies so far. And I have been making use of that strike right They don't seem to have much defense to them. Or have I just been getting criticals? No, I got some criticals. Because they have been taking a little less damage than my normal attacks on the uh, speckled rays were something like 130 to 150. That was 115, so a bit uh, more, a bit less. As from how far I am, I've still got a little bit to go. I'm halfway there. Ah, yeah, see you soon. Ah, there it is. Oh, well, I think that's it. Close enough. One thing you can do at sea, which I haven't shown before, but uh, what you can do is you can anchor. Go into the ship. So, it's a bit of a uh, cheap thing, but uh, go to uh, rest a little. At least I don't think I've shown this. Full health. And depart. So you could do this after every single fight if you wanted to. I haven't been because I haven't needed to, but uh, it is possible. But uh, we are almost at the Den of Pirates now, and I don't want to go into this without full health. 
we've been invited, yes, but um, we're still going into a den of pirates. I don't know about you, but uh, going into a den of pirates isn't really the first choice of anything normal adventurers would want to go into. Where is this? Uh, there it is. Took our time getting here, but here we are. Little secluded cave on an island far away from civilization. The perfect hiding spot, especially for fugitives that now, we are now. Now, please come inside. We could go inside, but uh, I believe there are a few items on the uh, sand out here. Like this treasure map. We've got a pilot who will strengthen weapons up to level 9, but our uh, person also does that on the ship. Uh, But, uh, saw a mermaid at sea around here. He's actually given a hint for a certain, uh, thing that we can do. Once we get a specific person. We haven't got that person just yet, or the availability for it, so we can't do it just yet. Pilot braces. Have the pirate bandana. Let's give you the pirate bracelet as well. And yeah, that should do for now. So, anything else? Most of the pirates around here are kind at heart. Hmm, only most. This person will sell items. Always useful. Any print bargain? No. I think he's this the time this time of games version of cheaper earlier. I think he's got the same items. Nothing particular wrong there. Hmm. And someone just wanted to go. What do you want? Because they can. Pretty rowdy, you could say. But uh, everyone here is just having food, I guess. Phil Taylor. He would prefer more people, so invite him some other time. Some people in this game, you need to acquire a certain amount of uh, people, uh, first, a certain number of recruits before others join up. Phil is one of those people. I can't remember how many he wants, but uh, once we get enough, we can talk to him and he will join us. We've got the inn there. Not that I really need to rest right now. And have a seat. I guess we're I guess we're having a seat. Been a while. Yeah. So, why did Kuluk suddenly invade your kingdom? If it was Scarlet Moon or Gaian, I could understand, but... They can't take others like Gaian head-on. 
I presume their first move will be to colonize the islands to the south. From there, they'll secure resources. I suppose that's their strategy, but time will tell. Cray Trading Company also bothers me. Their recent activities just don't add up. I'm thinking the two might be related somehow. Cray Trading Company? We've been letting those maggots have their way far too often! Hmm. But if they've joined forces with Kuluk, Cray Trading Company will be impossible to take on by ourselves. Hmm. So, how about it? Miss Kika, what do you say we join forces and take them on together? Hey, does he know who he's talking to? We're pirates! For the king to suggest something so rebellious... What's wrong with two parties banding together for a common interest? Don't you agree? Well, for a common interest, yeah, we should fight together. Well, I suppose it couldn't hurt. So, he'll be the one in command of your ship, am I right? Yep, that's right. Hmm, in command, even over the king? I don't really get it. Well, you're not the first person to notice that, but... Aboard a ship, the captain has absolute command, Dario. You should know that. I suppose that for the sake of a common goal, I will place my trust in you. Let us fight together. So, we have got the pirates on our side. Didn't take much convincing, did they? Just one mention of the word Trey Trey Trading Company. And we have got everyone. All of them are on the ship are on our ship at the moment, but they, that's not all that we get. We don't just get them as people. We get something else. But I believe there's a treasure map somewhere in this room. There it is. And an ocean rune piece. Excellent. Any treasure maps in the centre bit? No? Okay. Yeah. We don't just get... Kika and her pirates. We also get something else. Something that she has in her possession. Yeah, let's go back on board the ship. See that ship next to us? We also get Kika's ship, her pirate ship herself. We now have two ships in our fleet. So, if in, in any uh, large-scale battles now, we now have the ship of Obel and Kika's pirate ship. Nothing else really to help us, but uh, at least we've got a bit of help in the battle. As for... The people themselves. Let's go downstairs and have a look at them, shall we? Desmond, you will do just fine. Uh, change members. One thing I am going to do is Mitzvah is going to be coming out for Kika. That is guaranteed. And I'm not so sure if I can check this. Right, 
right now, but uh, let's put Sigurd, Hervey, Dario. Let's check, check see if I can actually see them. Oh yes, I can. Excellent. Right. Kika, Falcon Rune. It's a special rune. It's only for Kika. Much like the Shrike rune is only for Mizuki, Kika has the Falcon rune. The Falcon rune is very similar. It doubles the amount of ta her ta attack power for free a turn. So it's extremely nice. As a fighter though, um, she's not amazing I would say. She has Disha as a weapon which is level 5 at the moment. The only one I'm really set on at this moment in time for characters is uh, Mizuki because her strike rune and her ability to use it is quite good. Her magic is quite high. Her attack power gets quite high as well. Kika, not so much because she's level 30 and only has three level 1 MP. So her MP is a little bit low for my tastes. But uh, we'll see. She also has something else. Uh, which is also one of the reasons why I've got her in, which we will see eventually. Sigurd is level 27 and 4 and 1. So he's the pirate. This is the common theme about the pirates. Their MP is always quite low. Sigurd has pretty decent um, uh, damage and a water rune, but again, magic uh, magic is quite low. Hervey is the same. He has broadsword and a fire rune, but again, with very little magic and MP, what's the point of having a rune like that? And there's finally Dario, who is in the same boat, only level 23, so he's a bit lower with, with uh, so his magic is actually a bit better for some reason. Odd. He has a wood splitter, he comes, with, he is basically an axe user. Weapon level 1, so it would take a bit to get it up, and very little in the way of equipment. Oh, uh, what else? We got. Uh, that's not the one I wanted to do, but uh, we can at least find them on the thing here. There's Dario, the Chibi Star. Nalio, that's the person I need to find out about. There's Kiko, the Tenko star. Sigurdod Hervey, the cheeky star, and the Chimol star. Right. Change uh, party members, because... Nalio. Found treasure. So he is a support that allows you to find treasure more commonly. I'm going to stick with Cedric because Cedric does the same thing. I don't really need the healing one because I, at this moment in time I can just go onto the uh, ship and then, well, heal up by sitting on my bed for an hour or so. Any comments? Ah, uh, we've got a few. Please increase the number of room cannons. Yeah, that might be helpful if we get into a fight. 
it's about just saying hi. Lots of these are just saying hi once we recruit them, or if we do something like losing the uh, no, beating Vita. And again, just people saying thank you for lending us board the ship and being around. I believe we need to go into the war room next. No? I guess not. So, where do we have to go? us to go places. Oh, do I need to, uh, I might need to go back into, uh, the nest of pirates. But let's move out a little bit first. nothing going on out here. Sometimes when you go to a place you have to leave and go a bit further out into the sea before an event happens or something like that. But uh, I actually need, forgot to uh, equip Kika. But that's, uh, that's Falcon. It does double the amount of damage that she can uh, dishes out, but it's spaced over a lot of hits. And since she's got so low defense at the moment... Hmm. But, uh, yeah, let's go... I'm going to go and equip her up, and next time I think we'll go back into the pilot's nest. So, back into the ship I go. I'm going to rest as well, because why not, and next time back to the pilot's nest. Hopefully we can figure out what we're doing because again there's no actual indication of what to do hmm. until then have a wonderful day have lots of fun goodbye